Green Revolution In the mid and late 20th century, a revolution occurred that dramatically changed the field of agriculture. And this revolution was known as the Green Revolution. The Green Revolution was a period when the productivity of global agriculture increased drastically as a result of new advances. During this time, new chemical fertilizers and synthetic herbicides and pesticides were created. The chemical fertilizers made it possible to supply crops with extra nutrients and therefore increase yield. The newly developed synthetic herbicides and pesticides controlled weeds, deterred or killed insects and prevented diseases which also resulted in higher productivity. In addition to this, high yield crops were also developed and introduced. High yield crops are crops that are specifically designed to produce more overall yield. A method known as multiple cropping was also implemented during the Green Revolution and led to higher productivity. Multiple cropping is when a field is used to grow two or more crops throughout the year so that the field constantly has something growing on it. These new farming techniques and advances in agricultural technology were utilized by farmers all over the world and when combined intensified the results of the Green Revolution. Benefits of the Green Revolution As a result of the Green Revolution and the introduction of chemical fertilizers, synthetic herbicides and pesticides, high yield crops and the method of multiple cropping, the agricultural industry was able to produce much larger quantities of food. The increase in productivity made it possible to feed the growing human population. In the 1940s, agricultural scientist Norman Borlaug developed a strain of wheat that could resist diseases, was short, which reduced damage by wind and could produce large seed heads and high yields. He introduced this variety of wheat in Mexico and within 20 years the production of wheat had tripled. This allowed for the production of more food for people in Mexico and other countries. In addition to producing larger quantities of food, the Green Revolution was also beneficial because it made possible to grow more crops on roughly the same amount of land with a similar amount of effort. This reduced production costs and also resulted in cheaper prices for food in the market. The ability to grow more food on the same amount of land was also beneficial. The fact that from 1961 to 2008, as the human population increased by 100% and the production of food rose by 150%, the amount of forests and natural land converted to farm only increased by 10%. Drawbacks Although the Green Revolution had several benefits, there were also some issues associated with this period had affected both the environment and society. The use of chemical fertilizers and synthetic herbicides and pesticides dramatically influenced the environment by increasing pollution and erosion.